In this video, you are going to learn 10 types of logos for different brand strategy. Whether you are designing your logo yourself or outsourcing it to a freelance graphic designer, it's important to have an idea of what type of logo you want and what type of logo is suitable in your industry. In the next 10 days, I'll be designing one logo type per day, starting with Brandmark's logo. And in the end, I'll be sharing relevant documents and information on how to work with clients. This includes brief interpretation, pricing, exporting assets, and so on. So I invite you to join this tour by asking you to subscribe so you don't miss a thing. Without much ado, let's jump right into it. This video is brought to you by Brandon Graphics Channel, and my name is Vincent Annie. A logo is a visual symbol that identifies a company, an organization, or a product. A logo can be a letter, a text, an image, or a combination of them. The primary purpose of a logo is to help people recognize and remember the brand, its product or service. Hence, a good logo must be simple, yet unique. Following the principles of logo design, as you will soon see in this video. Let's check out some of the base logos. You notice how they follow the principles of logo design. They are simple, memorable, balanced, and versatile. Having laid the foundation, let's go on describing the 10 logo types. Number one in my list is the brand mark logo, also known as the Victoria mark. Or logo symbol. Examples of brand mark logos the iconic Apple logo, the Shell Shell, the Twitter Bird, and the Target Bull's Eye. The brand mark uses an icon or graphic image of a real life object to tell stories for what the brand does. The Twitter logo is a bird, which reminds us of what the brand does. It tweets. Brand mark logo can also represent the brand name. Examples of companies whose logos represent their names are Shell and Apple when to use brand mark logo. This type of logo can be tricky and challenging for a company whose identity is little known. Brand mark logo is suitable for businesses with known products or services. And that is, if your product or name can be represented by a real life object. YouTube logo shows the a video streaming company where Apple logo represents its name. Choosing the icon for this logo type can be challenging. The company will have to decide whether to choose an icon that represents its name or its services. Wordmark logo, also known as logo types. Examples of wordmark logos Coca Cola, Visa, Google, and eBay. Wordmark logo is simply the company name designed with suitable typeface or font. It doesn't include any icon or graphic image, just the font. Designing this type of logo is not as easy as it seems. The designer must pay attention to details to incorporate relevant design elements that will breathe life into the ordinary font. Here are a few things to keep in mind if you are going for a wordmark logo. Choosing a font type that reflects your brand vibe can be a difficult task. Your choice of font will make or break your logo design. Choose fonts that will stand the test of time. Think of a sans serif font if you are going for a sleek and clean look and feel. FedEx combined two sans serif fonts, Universe 67 and the Futura Bold. eBay used Universe 53. Vimeo used a serif font, Black Rose, to create the indie feel that goes with independent video sharing platform. You can create a custom made font just like the Coca Cola logo. This can take quite some time to perfect and a lot of work and skill, but in the end, it will be worth it. Sans Serif is great for branding, in tech, consulting, architectural, law, and so on. 
Serif font is good for brands with traditional industries. Script font will be good in personal branding or luxury businesses. When to use Wordmark logo. Wordmark logo is suitable for companies with short and catchy names. Examples Wiz, Casper, Kellogg's, and eBay. If your business name is lengthy or consists of multiple words, you will have to consider monogram or letter mark logos. If you are planning to diversify your business, Wordmark logo is for you. FedEx uses the same logo across its businesses. Each of the businesses is differentiated with a different color of EX at the end of FedEx. Combination Mark True to its name, Combination Mark logo combines graphic images and words to create one logo. It combines an icon and word mark or a mascot and letter form. Some brands that use this type of logo enjoy the flexibility of splitting up the image and text of this logo, using only one of them whenever it's suitable. Examples Lacoste, Dropbox, Dove, and NBC. When to use combination mark logo. Startup companies and businesses that are not well known will benefit from using combination mark logo. This is because adding text to your logo icon will throw more light on what your business is all about. Established companies take advantage of the versatile nature of this type of logo. They use only the text or the logo image and yet remain recognizable. Examples make this Benz, Adidas, Chanel, Burger King. Lacoste, Puma, Mastercard, Dropbox, PayPal, and Pepsi. Emblem logo. Examples: Starbucks, Harley Davidson, Warner Brothers, and BMW. Emblem is one of the oldest forms of logo type. Usually, it comprises of a vintage style test encased in a shape, circular shape, or shield, or other shapes. Think of crests, badges, and seals. This type of logo is popular amongst the traditional industries such as education, coffee brand, and sports. Emblem logo conveys seriousness, stability, and uh, authority. When to use emblem logo? Use an emblem logo if your business falls under the traditional industry. Do not use an emblem logo if your business name cannot easily be integrated into the emblem, unless you plan to shorten that like BMW. Be cautious when choosing this logo because it's not versatile, it can even lose clarity when scaled down. Mascot logo Examples KFC, Pringles, Geico, and Duolingo. Mascot logo consists of an illustrated character that acts as an ambassador for the brand. It gives its customers and audience a persona to relate to and form a connection with. Mascot logos are often engaging, fun and friendly, therefore you see them a lot in children's brands. Sports teams, service companies, food brands and recently tech and apps use this logo type. When to use mascot logo. Companies that want relatability should use mascot to humanize their brand. Avoid mascot if you are going for a professional image. Mascot is usually perceived as less serious and professional. Letter marks or monogram logo. Examples of companies that use this type of logo HP, CNN, LG, and IBM. Monogram logo uses one to four letters to create an appealing and memorable logo. It's often the first letter or the initials of the brand name. If you're a newcomer, consider putting your business name under the logo to build recognition. Then to use monogram logo. When your brand name is long, you can easily use the initials to create a memorable logo.
When you are running an international business, Monogram logo helps to reduce the language barrier. Monogram logo is more popular in certain professions such as law, government agencies, and financial institutions. Letter forms logo. Examples of companies that use this type of logo McDonald's, Netflix, Facebook, and Skype. Letter forms logos consist of one letter, which is usually the first letter of the company's name. Companies with this type of logo usually have a primary logo, which is the full version logo comprising the business name and other graphic elements. This could be a wordmark or logo type. This type of logo is ideal for app icons, favicon, or social media profile. They are small and are easily scalable to any screen size. Going to use letter forms logo. If your brand is relatively known, the letter form logo is great for you. Also, established companies can consider this type of logo during rebranding. Dynamic logo. Examples of companies that use dynamic logos are FedEx, Google, Nickelodeon, and Virgin. By simply changing or maintaining icon, shape, or color of part of the logo, one logo can be used for chains or businesses under the same parent company. When to use dynamic logo. When a business has a plan of expanding or diversifying, the parent company should consider using color, shapes, or icon to create a dynamic logo. Abstract logo. Examples of companies that use abstract logo. Chanel, Nike, Pepsi, and Google Drive. Unlike pictorial logo, that uses real-life objects to depict a brand name or essence. An abstract logo uses abstract symbols to tell stories behind the brand. Before you can create this type of logo, you must know the story behind the brand. A good abstract logo must have a meaning. The Mitsubishi logo consists of three diamonds. Mitsubishi is a combination of two Japanese words, Misu, which means three, and Hishi, which means rumbus or diamond shape. The founder chooses this diamond mark suggestive of the three leaf emblem of the Tosa kingdom and the three stacked rumbai of Iwasaki family crest. The logo also stands for the company values, integrity, success, and reliability. And finally, we have 3D logos. Examples of companies that use 3D logos are Sony Ericsson, Xbox 360, Firefox, and Nerf. In our digital world, some brands are exploring beautiful and bold 3D logos. 3D logos are vibrant, clear, and bold. And finally, let's look at principles of logo design. A good logo should be simple, memorable, modern, yet timeless, original, versatile, and scalable, quality typeface, strategic with color, look great in black and white, balance, stay on brand, and audience-oriented. And just before you go, I would like to remind you to join us every day for the next 10 days. I will be designing one logo type per day. You will get to ask questions and some of the logos will be designed on my live session. So join us by subscribing to my channel. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video, Mastering Adobe Illustrator Tools for Logo Design.